Most people hate going to the mechanic. Every time they go, they feel like they're charged way too much. And sometimes it feels like the mechanic shop absolutely robs you. One of the worst parts of going to the mechanic is when you have to replace your old car battery with a new overpriced battery. But luckily, there's now a way to revive old used car batteries. So instead of buying a new car battery, you can now recondition and reuse your old battery instead. This also works with power tool batteries, other types of lead acid batteries, laptop and cell phone batteries, plus a whole lot more. This new simple method can save you thousands of dollars through the years on the cost of batteries. So if you want to stop getting ripped off by the mechanic, click the link below now. And if you're ready to start saving thousands of dollars through the years on the cost of batteries, you're going to want to check this out. So go ahead, click the link below now. People all over the world are using a dead simple trick to bring nearly any type of dead battery back to life again. People like Jen Simmons, who brought a dead car battery, a dead cell phone battery, a dead drill battery, a dead camera battery, and many other types of dead batteries back to life again, just like new. And people like Kevin Day, who brought his dead drill battery, several dead double and triple A batteries, and his dead camera battery back to life again. It's easy to bring dead batteries back to life again with this new simple trick. Today, I'm going to reveal to you the simple battery reconditioning resource that I've been using over the past year that has let me easily bring dead batteries back to life again, just like new. Over the past year, over 19,000 people have also already successfully used this to recondition their old batteries back to 100% of their original working condition again. This battery breakthrough is saving people hundreds of dollars a year and will save them thousands of dollars over their lifetime because instead of buying overpriced batteries, people can now recondition and reuse their old batteries. Most people don't even know they can bring dead batteries back to life, let alone how simple and quick it is. A year ago, I was one of those people until I discovered EZ Battery Reconditioning. It's the step-by-step -step system that anyone can use to recondition all kinds of old or dead batteries right from home. It's simple, quick, and absolutely anyone can use it, even if you know nothing about batteries, like me. Since I've been using EZ Battery Reconditioning, I've been able to recondition all kinds of dead batteries, from car batteries, power tool batteries, the motorcycle batteries, and many other types of common batteries. There are even places where I have been able to find free used batteries that I can recondition and use in my family's electronics, devices, and automobiles. Once I learned about some of the sources of free old batteries in the Easy Battery Reconditioning, it's almost like I have an endless supply of free batteries. I even started reselling many of these, and it's providing an incredible side income already. Over the past year, I've gotten to know the co-creator of Easy Battery Reconditioning. His name is Tom Erickson. Tom's a family man with a wife and three children living right outside of Charleston, South Carolina. And the story of how he learned how to bring dead batteries back to life is fascinating and a little heartbreaking. It's been seven years since Tom paid for a new battery. And in this short presentation, Tom will teach you about this simple and incredibly effective way of bringing dead batteries back to life again. What's great about the battery reconditioning system is it's something that you will benefit from for the rest of your life. You learn it once and reuse it every time when your battery gets old or dies. Tom also talks about his friend Frank, who makes an incredible income selling reconditioned batteries in today's short presentation. So, without further ado, here's Tom. Hi, my name is Tom Erickson, and today in this short presentation, I'll tell you how I discovered how to easily bring nearly any type of dead battery back to life again, just like new. It might sound crazy, but you'll soon see how any family around the world can now use simple methods to recondition old batteries back to 100% of their original working condition again. So now, instead of buying new, overpriced batteries every time one gets old or dies, people can recondition and reuse their old batteries instead saving them thousands of dollars on the cost of batteries over their lifetime. Over this past year alone, over 19,541 people have already successfully used these very same methods to bring their old batteries back to life again. People like Jeff Dobbins from Savannah, Georgia, who was able to recondition his old car battery in only 25 minutes with our simple methods. 
His old car battery was once completely dead, but now works like new again, saving him $120 on a new battery. And then there's Jen Simmons from Sacramento, California. She reconditioned several dead car batteries, a cell phone battery, a drill battery, as well as several other types of dead batteries with these exact same simple methods, saving her over $400 on batteries so far. Or Frank Murray from Adelaide, Australia. He used the same simple method you're about to discover in this presentation to quickly bring two dead car batteries back to life again. And then there's Cecile Neal from Ottawa, Canada. She reconditioned 17 old batteries back to life again. The methods are so simple to do, she even said her son is even using them now. And with these simple techniques, you can not only save thousands of dollars over your lifetime by reusing old batteries instead of buying new overpriced batteries, you'll also have the ultimate peace of mind because if the batteries in your family's essential electronics, vehicles, or devices ever die when you need them most, like in a power outage, you'll be able to bring those batteries back to life again in a matter of minutes. So you and your family are never without important, even life-saving devices when you need them most. If this interests you, then you really need to watch this short presentation today while it's still up. This is probably not like anything you've ever seen before. And I should warn you that in a couple minutes, you'll probably be upset you've been paying so much for new overpriced batteries over the years. But I don't know how much longer I can leave this free presentation up, so watch this right now while you still can. Before we continue, let me quickly tell you who I am and the shocking way I discovered this. At first, I didn't want to tell you this story. It's painful and felt too private to share. However, these painful events led us to the incredible discovery that now lets us bring nearly any type of dead battery back to life again, which has already saved my wife and I thousands of dollars and has even allowed us to power our home with off-grid energy. And I know this is far too important to hide. So here's what happened. Now, like I mentioned, my name is Tom Erickson. I live right outside of Charleston, South Carolina with my wife and three children. And it all started the day my wife anxiously whispered in my ear, it's either food for the kids or this battery. I was standing next to her in the mechanic shop and I remember the look of fear and anxiety on her face when she said that. It was heartbreaking. I was ashamed things had come to this. My car's battery should have lasted another two years. And with my hours at work recently getting cut back, my wife and I couldn't afford another brand new battery right now. We were already barely scraping by and needed the last $200 in our bank account for bills, and more importantly, to buy food to feed our children that week. So when the mechanic told us it would be $180 to replace my car's battery, it felt like a dagger in my heart. Three weeks prior, we spent $190 on another new battery for my wife's SUV, and that battery should have lasted another year and a half. We also had to replace my laptop battery, a few AA and AAA batteries, even my drill battery, all in the same month. With our tight funds, it was a financial nightmare. But this new car battery was going to push our total battery expenses to over $450 this month. And I knew if we purchased this new car battery, it would be the final nail in our family's financial coffin. The situation felt desperate, and at this time, I didn't know much about batteries and just figured there wasn't much I could do. I thought batteries die, and when they do, you have to replace them with new expensive batteries. So when we were left with the decision to either get a new car battery or use the last $200 in our bank account to purchase food to feed our children that week, the decision was pretty easy. So we left the mechanic shop in my wife's car and shared rides for the next three weeks while I searched around to see if we had any other options besides buying a new expensive battery for my car. I searched everywhere and talked to anyone who knew anything about batteries, but it seemed like we had no other options. I was devastated. And just when things were starting to look hopeless, I discovered the secret that finally changed everything for our family. I met a man named Frank Thompson. Now, I used to work for a golf cart company, and oftentimes we'd get in old golf carts and the used batteries in the golf carts would be completely dead. So we'd have to take them out and replace them. And by the end of each month, we'd always have a huge collection of old dead batteries just lying around. But like clockwork, there used to be a man named Frank Thompson that would come by each month to collect the dead batteries. We used to call Frank the Battery Man. My manager had no clue why we always wanted our dead batteries. He was just glad to get rid of them, so they were out of our way. 
But Frank must have known something about dead batteries that we didn't. Otherwise, why would he spend all of this time hauling them away for free? So the following month, when Frank came in again, I nearly cornered him and asked him what he did with all of our old dead batteries. I recondition them and sell them for a nice profit, he said. How do you do that, I asked. They're completely dead. He just smirked and said, that's my secret. Sorry, pal. I immediately started wondering if this would also work on my car's dead battery. So I asked if he knew how to recondition any other kinds of batteries besides dead golf cart batteries. And when I asked that, his eyes lit up and he proudly exclaimed, I can recondition almost any kind of dead battery. Anything from car batteries, to power tool batteries, to laptop batteries, to cell phone batteries, to rechargeable batteries. Even solar power batteries, deep cycle marine batteries, and forklift batteries. Plus a whole lot more. Right away, I knew this was the solution I was looking for. I could hardly contain myself and basically beg Frank to teach me his battery reconditioning methods. He had a busy day and was a little reluctant at first, but luckily Frank is a really good guy, and when I explained to him my situation, he gave in. And in the next 30 minutes, he showed me exactly how to recondition several types of batteries using just a couple simple steps. To be honest, I was pretty shocked at how fast and easy it was. I was thinking it was going to be something technical, time-consuming, or hard. But nope, it really couldn't be easier. And not just that. To recondition these batteries, he only used a couple inexpensive things that most people already have sitting around in their kitchen or garage. So right when work ended that day, I rushed to my wife's work to pick her up, because we were still sharing her car at this point, and we headed straight to the mechanic shop where my car and its dead battery were still at. Immediately when we arrived, I ran over to my car, tried the method Frank taught me for car batteries, and in a matter of minutes, the battery was back to life, just like new. My wife and I could hardly contain our excitement. And just like that, our nightmare was over. Our problem was solved, and that simple method just saved us $180. But that was just the tip of the iceberg, because our minds started racing. We had many other types of dead batteries lying around our home. In fact, we had a whole drawer filled with dead batteries. So when we got home, we started collecting every dead battery we could find. We tried the simple battery reconditioning methods on them that Frank taught me, and one after another, each battery came back to life again, just like new. A dead drill battery, a dead laptop battery, an old cell phone battery, an old boat battery, long life batteries, and a box of old rechargeable batteries. One after the other, they were all back to 100% of their original working condition again. And each battery we reconditioned was saving us $10 here, $7 there, $40 here, even $180 for the marine battery. And since this day, we've saved thousands of dollars because we haven't had to buy one new battery for our family's electronics, devices, or vehicles. I also have the ultimate peace of mind knowing that if batteries in my family's essential electronics, vehicles, or devices ever die during a critical time, like in a power outage, I can easily bring those batteries back to life again in a matter of minutes. So we're never without important, even life-saving devices when we need them most. Not just that, for years, my wife and I had wanted to use solar panels to lower our power bills and become more energy independent. We had begun buying solar panels for our home, but the thing that was holding us back from completing our system was the cost of the battery bank, which costs thousands of dollars. But in my research, I found out that golf cart batteries are actually some of the best and most popular batteries you can use for a solar panel system because of their deep cycle properties. So the following day, I asked my boss if I could have some of our dead golf cart batteries. When I did, he just looked at me a little strange and said, take all you like. And that night, I was able to recondition these and build a battery bank for my solar panel system with a bunch of batteries I got for free. And if you click the link below, you can learn how to do this too. So go ahead, click the link below now.